Hi everyone, today we are going to learn about allegory. But before I start this lecture, if you are new in my lecture, please like and subscribe the channel. Well, whenever we explain something, so first we define it. So let me define it and after that I'll explain it. So the definition is, it refers to a narrative which consists of a story within a story. What does it mean by this short definition? Simply, it means when a story is composed in a such a way that it consists of a surface story and another story hidden underneath. So simply we can call it allegory. I think still you are not getting the point. So let me make it easier for you. So let's suppose you are a writer and you want to write something about politics, religion or morality. But the subject is difficult to comprehend for readers. Because the subject you are going to convey is something abstract. But you represent that abstract concept through characters, actions and dialogues, etc. So obviously there will be a surface story and the hidden story. In English literature you might have studied Fairy Queen by Edmund Spencer and it is an allegory. Basically the good characters in the book stand for the virtues and the bad characters stand for voices. For example, the character Red Cross Knight stands for holiness and Lady Una stands for truth and the dragon represents evil. So simply it is an allegory because there is a story behind another story. We have another example Animal Farm by George Orwell and it is also allegory because it tells us a story of a group of animals who rebel against their human farmer, hoping to create a society where the animal can be equal, free and happy. But the question is why we call it allegory? The answer is because when we read it so we find animals which are talking and communicating one another. But actually it is not about just animals. But it represents the events in people of Russian revolution. So therefore it is allegory because in surface we are just reading about animals. But the deep and hidden message is about Russian revolution. So that is why it is also allegory. Well guys if you like my video please like and subscribe the channel. And see you next time. Bye bye.